Oh yeah, one more thing. The other thing that I've got in my everyday carry is a handy dandy iPhone because it's got a compass, it's got survival information, it's got all kinds of stuff that you wouldn't believe on here. It's got maps, it's got GPS, um, it's awesome. They know where you are at all times. So, you know, if someone really wanted to find you in an emergency, they probably wouldn't use that. But if they're, you were doing something bad and they wanted to find you, they probably would. So, you know, it's, it's, a, it's a double edged sword, but I think it's good because I never do anything wrong. And so that's why I'm not afraid of my government, like this NDAA. You know, hey, I don't do anything wrong. So, I mean, they can come and uh, search me or torture me or whatever because. I'm a good guy and I don't do bad stuff. I mean, the, bad, the worst thing I do is these stupid videos and that's not against the law yet. So I don't have anything to, to hide. So I wouldn't care if they squeeze my balls or um, wanna look through all my stuff or wanna search me or torture me to see if I'm a bad guy. I mean, I'm fine with that, you know, because I haven't done anything wrong. So I have nothing to fear. The ultimate SAS survival app. This is good. So anyway, this, this sucker has everything you need to survive. So this is the other thing that I have for my every, everyday carry. Now I'm thinking about carrying a power cord and all kinds of other stuff for the, for the iPhone, but I haven't gotten around to it yet because I'm too lazy. But uh, I'm thinking about it. So Now it also helps you navigate with stars. Um, this is actually really good for you idiots in suburbia that don't know what the hell is going on, but you've got like an iPhone. Um, so you can figure out where the stars are and stuff of that nature and um, let me see where's mine I think it's called like stargazer but I didn't uh, I gotta find it here um, no sky safari that's even better so sky safari that could help you navigate because actually I mean it'll tell you which way is north but also, you can put in the, the day or the hour, and it'll tell you where stuff is. And uh, like, uh, bu -bu 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 -bu. what is this? So if I put in, mother, I, I closed it. Search. So the North Star is also goes by Polaris like polar bears, Polaris, po, po, my eyes are starting to go on me, I guess I'm getting old, polar, if, polarith, uh, well it doesn't even have, okay, how about North Star, Fulio, North Star, I can't spell star, nor, I can't spell North, uh, North Star Star and Center. So this is actually you can also you can also put this in the future. So this is January fourth, twenty twelve, but uh, it shows uh, where the North Star is. So you know this is a way where you can you can navigate and. You know, you can see where stuff is, and this would help you navigate by the stars because you can actually, you know, zoom in and figure out what stuff is. And, uh, and you know, I need to take this. This is annoying. I need to take this off of the, uh, and put it for now. 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 Oh, January 4, 2012. Holy crap, we're living in the future. Weird. So anyway, if I wanted to find the North Star, then I could just shake it up and it'll show me where the North Star is. And... Well, there it is right there. So anyway, I know that's North because I just found it on my fancy iPhone. See? Right there. Anyway, now it moved. All right, whatever.